Hey guys, what's up? So, I haven't streamed this game in a while. I streamed it back like two years ago when I was still streaming on YouTube and it was so much fun talking about like Happy Meal toys and McDonald's and all kinds of stuff in the chat and then at the time I think it was my highest viewed um, like uh, stream that I like later uploaded. So you know what, let's have some of my kids. I don't know if we're going to beat it, but let's play it for a good amount of time. Billy Mount says, did I go to Japan in that photo with Pikachu? No. Well, I went to Japan in Epcot in Disney World and I took that picture with Pikachu. <laughs> Thanks so much, Talking Crow. What's up? How are you this evening? Hey guys, we got... Who do we got? We got Phallus, we got Big Jetta, we got Nintendo Fan, we got Philly Beefcake, Billy Mount, Cyborg Cable, Rocksteady, Charging Charlie, Chris C, uh, Mirth, Stampede, Talking Crow, Churchy, and Axebox. Alright, so we got some people in here. Oh, uh, thank you, Chris. That's cool, Stampede. It's Pokemon in Disneyland, Japan. Um, I don't know, but in Epcot Center, they have, like, um, the World Showcase where there's a pavilion for Japan, um, Italy, Germany, Canada, U.S., everywhere. And so in Japan, they have a store that has a lot of Pokemon and Sailor Moon and stuff like that. So I went there and I took a picture with Pikachu. All right. So let's start some mitt kits. Got my coffee already this time. I'm drinking it pretty fast, so I take a break and get some more. Thank you so much, Charging Charlie. Charging Charlie. Alright, so. What happens if you. You know what? Have I ever done this before? Oh, that changes like your character. Oh. I'm really surprised Mike and I haven't streamed this together yet. That big kids music, man, gets me going. So happy. I love this game. I don't care. I don't think it's a bad game. I mean, a lot of people shit on it because it's kind of a ripoff of Super Mario 3, but not totally. Like, it, it has its own thing going on. You know, you can walk upside down and stuff. Like, I think this is a really good game. Hey, a Spectre! Ronald was showing off his magic bag at a picnic in the meadow when all of a sudden... What if the clouds were M's? Wouldn't life be so much more magical? Cheaper Big Mac. Get McDouble with Mac sauce. You know what? I've heard about that, but I've never tried it. I should try that, Big Jetta. You think it's the best advertising game ever made? You know what? This was actually supposed to be free in every um, Happy Meal. And then the first time, I forget why, but they didn't do it, and then you could just buy it. McKids was one of the first angry video game nerd videos you saw. Yeah, that was one of the first ones I saw too, I think. Pr proudly from Maine. Isn't that a great one? Hey, Jingle Bell Rainbow. Am I eating McDonald's right now? No, but I wish I was. And confusing runaround. I agree with that. South Dog, like, it does get confusing. That's probably why I've never beaten it because I get annoyed and I need a break and then I never come back to it. Alright. Help, help. The Hamburglar has run off with my magic bag. Please help us get it back. Search the levels of my clubhouse and retrieve at least four of my puzzle cards. If you come back to my house with four cards, I will show you how to get to Birdie's house. Alright, so we gotta collect a bunch of cards. It kind of becomes a bitch later on. Hey E-Tank! I know, I'll, I'll do Castlevania 3 Japan at some point. It's just, I feel like I've been oversaturating the Castlevania. Like, um, you know I just per recently put out the YouTube video and I've been playing it a lot. 
But I know you guys love it, so I'll get back to it soon. It's just I personally need a break from Castlevania. And I know this game is chill. This this game is very not chill. But I think it's fun. Thank you, Shishi. Yeah, I'm trying something different. I want to try pigtails or like a ponytail or something. And all of a sudden I just did it and I was like, you know what? I can it's alright. You only live once, you know? Hey Robux! Do I remember the movie Mac and Me? Yeah, I saw it for the first time not that long ago. And it's... I don't know. I know a lot of people have like fond childhood memories of it. I don't. I like... There were some parts that were terrifying, like when the alien family is like rising from the fucking flames in the grocery store parking lot. It was just weird. There's weird imagery. Robux! Nin fan. Your order is just mac sauce and shredded lettuce. A Tamara snap? I don't know what that is. Alright, so I'm gonna get going. It's so fun to talk about McDonald's though. I should do an IRL stream where we can just talk about McDonald's. This can be a little bit of both. How about that? Whoop! No! Boop, boop. Boing! Oh! Oh! Can we hit that? Nope. Okay, so I think we come back for this. So is there anyone in here that's never played this game? And then I think to go upside down we do this. Woo! So we got a card. Oh, oh yeah, what's up here? So it's been a little bit since I've played this, but... Ah, see, that's how we get the other ones. Alright, so I'm gonna stop being upside down. Wait. Hold on. Ah! Fuck. Damn it! This works. Can you put me right side up? Person. Just give me a second here to get... See, I need to be able to jump on this big one. Damn it! Fuck! Okay, so I need to find a thing that's easy to get to so I can flip back. <sighs> I don't remember having much trouble with this part. Oh fuck, we were so close. There's one right there. So if you don't know what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to flip back the right direction. And I can only do it on platforms that have this little turny thing at the end. So, fuck. So that's what I'm trying to do. Mm. Fuck! <laughs> so this is gonna be the first 30 minutes of the stream. Is me trying to... Uh. Uh. I need some coffee. What are you guys talking about? Hey games and movies! You think this is a shitty game, games and movies? You should play it. I actually like this game a lot. But I understand why some people don't like it. Thank you for the Bits Philly Beefcake. I really appreciate that. That really helps me do these streams. And buy games that I've been meaning to buy. And all that good stuff. Thanks so much Sky Coaster Man for subscribing. Three months in a row. When will they fix Tomorrowland, Aaron? Don't get me on that rant, Sky Coaster. I have so many feelings about Tomorrowland in both parks. 
Mostly Tomorrowland and Disneyland. Hold down to jump higher. Thank you, Darth Sphinx. I'm trying something new. Okay, let's try it. Let's try it. Okay, so that's kind of what I was doing. Ooh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> Yay! Success! Thank you so much, Night Shift 62. Will I be playing G.I. Joe again? I will. You know what, I need to write that down because I need to practice that game a little bit more because it's just like, there's some like awkward stuff. Like, just basically, it's a tough game, but also like I, want, I need to get uh, more familiar with the different characters and stuff. So let me write that down. G.I. Joe. $10 on eBay? Yeah, it's not an expensive game. I got this a while ago, but it's, it's not that expensive. Ninja Gaiden 3? I would love to play more Ninja Gaiden 3. <clears throat> Did I ever play the Burger King games? Well, that question will be answered in my next YouTube video. Hint, 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 <laughs> What about the Tomorrowland movie with George Clooney? Um, yeah, I, I fucking hated that movie. I saw it, I was really stoked. Because, okay, I knew it was probably gonna suck, but I was like, oh my god, there's like, there's images from the World's Fair. Like, that's kind of cool. Shit, I forgot, you can't, you can't jump on enemies. Um, so, it's like, it had potential to be something cool and different, and it was kind of like, it didn't know what kind of movie it was supposed to be. Because there was one scene where like, it just got really goofy out of nowhere, that I don't really remember. Wait, what am I supposed to do here? Hold on, hold on, hold on. There was one scene, fuck. Okay, you know what, fuck it, whatever. Can fit in the game. Yeah, I should have jumped on the pole, but you know what? We can always go back. In this game, you can't go back and redo levels. I'm good, Luke. How are you? But yeah, so Tomorrowland the movie was just, I don't know, it was just such a shit show of a movie. I mean, I didn't expect it to be good, but it was just like... It's like aliens were kind of evolved or something. It sounds like Treasure Cove on PC. I don't know that one. Woo! I don't think there's anything there if I remember correctly. Damn it. Those pesky beavers. Those beavers. Is there McDonald's food in this? So what's weird, I have a lot of I have a lot of thoughts on this game, which is probably not surprising. So um this is a McDonald's game, but it's like the it's only McDonald's-y in the sense, like, that, um, hold on, it's only McDonald's-y in the sense that, like, you see, Mc like, the McDonald's characters in the cutscenes, and there's, like, M's for coins, but, um, other than that, there's really nothing McDonald's about it. And it sucks because it's like, I feel like they missed such an opportunity. Like, they could have had the Fry Guys in here. They could have done so much other stuff. So I, I don't know if it was some licensing thing or like they could only do so much. I don't know. 
but it's just kind of weird to me that the only thing McDonald's about it are like the in-between stuff. Wait, what's in here? Ooh! We found a secret. Or maybe we didn't. We don't- okay, so I guess- oh no, we did. Ooh! I don't think I've ever been here before. Ah. But yeah. And then, I also own the PAL version of this game, because I don't fuck around with my McDonald's games. And the, the cover is different, and it's called McDonald Land instead of McKids, but it's the same game. Oh, and then earlier, Luke, I was talking about Tomorrowland, the um, George Clooney movie that's a fucking shit show. What's up, New Wave Junkie? Thank you. They could have had Mayor McCheese as a character. What if you could choose your McDonald's? I mean, I know that kind of goes against the plot, but you could play as, like, other McDonald's characters. You could play as Fry Guys. There could be Fry Guys enemies and burger bushes, like, I could have designed a better game. They should have, they should have consulted me. I was probably like two years old when this came out, but still. Hamburger, Grimace, and Fried Kids stealing McD food up to Ronnie, Mayor McCheese, and Officer Big Mac to save the day. That's right, Terry Trojan. Wouldn't that have been a better plot? Did I put a lot of time into my YouTube thumbnails? Yes. I hate making thumbnails. So sometimes it can just... So I was talking about this with Mike the other day, and sorry, I will get back to the game. I just want to finish a thought. So basically... Okay, so first of all, I hate taking, like, finding the picture of myself to put on the thumbnail. Because it does get more clicks if my face is on it. When I... I did a Sunset Riders video early on, and that's the only thumbnail where I don't have my face on it, and it didn't get that many views. And I think it's because it doesn't matter if you're a chick or a dude, it's just people like to see the person in the video, I think, on the thumbnail. So now it's that, and it's like, okay, do I just film? And then at the end, sometimes I've just learned to just like go at the end, and then like I'll use, I'll just take a screen cap of that and whatever. Or then you gotta like pose for a picture, and I just hate taking selfies because I feel like a fucking idiot every time I do it. But it's just what you gotta do. And then you gotta pick the right one. And then you gotta try to put, because then you gotta try to put like text on there, and like the cover of the game, or something. Like the last thumbnail I did for Dracula's Curse, that took me forever because like I was feeling really shitty that day. And I was like... I don't want to take a picture and I tried and I was just like I look like crap and the second I was just like okay how about I use like a caption of me from the game but you know it was like not that good quality but then I found one and I was like I don't want to just put the Dracula's curse box behind it so then and it worked out but it took me forever to come up with that so basically thumbnails are a bitch to make because they are important because that's what that's what gets people to click so it's like, I gotta make sure I have all the elements I want in there, and it's just, they can take forever, and then you just hate it because you're spending forever on a thumbnail. Just really sucks. <laughs> Sorry, that was a long rant, but I have a lot of feelings about thumbnails. The M card is in the middle top of this level, okay. When does the new YouTube video come out? As soon as I'm done editing it, so probably within the next few days. You had Burger King yesterday? I haven't had Burger King in a while. <coughs> any Matlock games? No, but if there are any, let me know. Have I played Yonoid? A little bit. Um, not too much, but I would like to stream that soon. I was actually thinking about streaming that tonight. Yeah, thumbnails are something you're not looking forward to having to do. Yeah, it's just... Everyone finds their own style of thumbnail. The trials and tribulations of thumbnails. 
Yeah, I've also heard that YouTube's algorithm favors faces. That is, I think that's true. So, I always gotta put my face on there. And there's probably some people that are like, oh, look at this bitch. She thinks she needs her face on every thumbnail. It's like, yeah, actually I do because it makes people click on it and Google likes it. <laughs> do I miss Toys R Us? Yeah, I do. Do I own any of the McDonald's Genesis games? I own, um, what's it called? I have it right over there. Global Gladiators, yes. Okay, so let me try to get back over here, which won't happen. Damn it! Okay, I gotta redo this level. Just put a picture of my thumb next. Maybe that would work. Hey, Mr. JR! The chat's freezing up. You might just need a refresh. Sometimes that helps me if I'm in the chat and it's being weird. I feel like with Twitch, refreshing the page helps with like 90% of the problems. At least that I have. But you could be, you know, doing something totally different. Okay. Shit! Way to go, Aaron. Okay, I think I already did this, right? This is... Yeah, okay. I'm not gonna do that because hold on. That's it. Oh, you know what? I'm thinking of another level. Hold on. Where did you say this card was, Stampede Gaming? M card is in the middle top of this level. Okay, I'm gonna try to go up high again and try to find it. Hey runs over frogs. So my thumbnail was captured from video. Um the one on my the one that just came out of the Dracula's Curse playthrough, that was. That just was a screen cap of me, and then I stuck it on top of the final form of Dracula, so I get the point across. I'm like, yo, we're beating Dracula's Curse. Here's the girl playing it. Here's the game. Here's the title. It delivers everything you need to know about what you're about to click on. What about my middle finger? I don't know if Google would like that, games and movies. There are no OC remixes of this game? I don't know what you mean. Don't use my pictures for trolling purposes, Chris. I don't want to get into any shenanigans. Shit, did that thing go away? Ah, shit. I need to find this card. Hmm. Yeah, fuck you. See, he, he respawns. I hate that. I hate those beavers. Okay, now let's try to find... Is it up here? Nope. Ah. What's up? Uh, I agree. Gotta 
ride this around and see. It's over here. Ah, wait, did I go up here before? No, yeah, that's where I started. I grabbed it already? I don't remember grabbing it, but damn it! I might just restart since I've died. Actually, fuck it. Let's keep going. Okay, so I'm just gonna beat this level, because apparently I probably already got the card. If I didn't, I will try to find another card. fry guys are there? There's a lot. There's one with glasses, there's a pink one, there's a green one, there's a blue one. What's up, Dancing Danny? There are not there are not enough fry guys fry guys, that's very true. Little, them little chicken nugget dudes. Is this game in the McDonald's universe? Kind of Jingle Bell. Cause it's like this part, it's like, okay, you know, we, we see Ronald up there, we're collecting M's. But then it's like you got these bat these little badger dudes. Who are real bastards. They're not from McDonald Land. Oh man, this level is kind of a bitch. It's not that bad. Oh my god! See those fucking birds? Every video game, birds are the worst. It's like a fact. McNugget Buddies? You know what I can't believe I passed up on? I was at an antique store. And they had plushes of a Mc McNugget buddy dressed as a cop, and then a McNugget buddy dressed as a princess, and I didn't buy them. Like, why the fuck didn't I buy those? Ooh, that sounded good. Oh, here's a card. Cause see, sometimes I'm very like, I, I really control myself with what I buy. I'm like, don't buy that. The other times I buy shit I don't eat. And that was the time I should have bought something. Oh. I'll kill you. I don't like that jump. take a break from Castlevania's doom and gloom. You want McDonald's now? See, it's working. I am 31. Is there a McMuffin guy? There should be. I'd be very happy if there was a McMuffin guy. I should do like an in-depth video on this game. I'm honestly, oh shit. I'm honestly surprised that I haven't.
How the fuck? Okay, hold on. Just give me a minute. We're gonna do this. It's gonna be fine. <gasps> Up, I think, or I'm missing something obvious. Oh, I can I can jump up there. Okay, so I got that. Oh shit. Okay. Where do I get that? Did I see that? Did I waste it? Because it has to be a special block. Okay, there's a card. I don't think any block works for those things. Hmm. Yeah, I know hold down to jump higher, but sometimes it feels like it's not. Hot cakes. What's your favorite chicken sandwich from Burger King? That's my question. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah, I think I need the special block for this. Fuck. Okay, well. So apparently it's somewhere. I don't know where it is. Well, whatever. Look, here's a card. So we got one. I want to go up there. I like that noise so much. Okay, that's the only card. Thanks, Stampy. So, Burger King, they have like the tender crisp sandwich, which I used to like when I was younger. And then I had it again recently, and it was really bad, but I think it was just because they made it shitty. But then there's like, is the game too loud? Is that better, guys? But, um, and then there's like the long crispy chicken sandwich, and I've never had that one. So you guys should tell me, is that the good one? Is that the one you're talking about? The original? Wendy's spicy chicken? I've never had that. I've only had the regular spicy chicken. You like the long one. <laughs> When you see the big platform, you need to be holding a block to bounce high off. Okay. You worked at BK, do not eat there. I rarely eat there, Hickus, because like, there's just none really in my area. Like, there's one kind of close by, but it's like, I feel like a lot of Burger Kings are shutting down. The BK in your town is so sketchy. That's usually how it is, Dancy Danny. Thank you, Luke. Hold on guys, I gotta check something real quick. It's hard to find Dairy Queens in your town. Um, in California, there really wasn't a lot of Dairy Queens. There's one around here, but it's like seasonal. See, that's all new to me, stuff being seasonal. 
Um, wait, did I just do this level? God damn it. See, I'm not paying attention. Yes, I just did this one. Because I'm too busy talking about fast food that's really important. Woo! They're going bankrupt. Burger King. A and W. I was just talking about A and W the other day. Jingle Bell Rainbow. So in California, um, there was a A and W slash KFC, and that was the only time I ever seen or have heard of A and W fast food. Like I know they make uh, root beer and stuff, but that was the only time I ever saw that, and that didn't last long. And then it just became a normal KFC. But, um, hell yeah, I'm one-up. But, um, yeah, I don't, I, I don't know if I ever ate there. It's like burgers and fries and stuff, right? Yeah, I don't really like KFC. I don't, I don't know. It's like some fast food I really like, like Taco Bell I fucking love. Um, Wendy's is good. I haven't tried a lot of stuff at Wendy's yet, but, um, from what I've had, I've liked. Like, I think they're one of the better fast foods. Come back here, asshole. Fucking birds. I hate birds. I hate them. Okay, this is where we came from, right? This is what we did, I believe. Two beavers, ooh! Beaver. What? What did I even hit? Was it the bird? I thought I didn't hit the bird. Oh, so, Mike and I were talking the other day. Neither of us have ever had Wendy's breakfast. What do they even have for breakfast items? Do they even have breakfast? Hey, yellow buns. Long John Silvers. Oh my god, hush puppies. I haven't had Long John Silvers since I was like, like five, six. And then another thing is uh, Burger King breakfast. I, as a kid, I would get the French toast sticks every once in a while. But I haven't had Burger King breakfast in forever. Ooh, what's up here? Something up here? Nope. Burger King foot lettuce? Ew, what does that mean? You like how Taco Bell meat comes out of a chalk gun? That sounds disgusting, but you know what? I'm still gonna eat there. Have I ever had Dairy Queen food? I have not. Is their food good? I've only had their ice cream. Pizza Hut breakfast? That should be a thing. You know what I miss? I miss... Oh, there's two, there's two cars on stage th six? Thank you, Stampede Gaming. Um, what was I talking about? Pizza Hut. When you could go in there as a kid. Like, I have so many memories. Go on a Pizza Hut while I'm waiting for the pizza, or it's like if we eat there, you get those red cups, those red plastic cups. And, um, hold on. And then you get the pizza buffet or whatever. And then you go play the arcade. I remember I was so proud of myself. I had my name on the Simpsons arcade machine there for years. And, um, 
because I was just, like my parents, we'd order Pizza Hut a lot, but my mom would go in and pick it up. So while we'd wait, I'd like just go in the arcade area. And like, I don't know, just so many good memories. <laughs> I miss Pizza Hut. Because at least in California, a lot of them went out of business. And then if they were there, they were like Pizza Huts where you can't eat there, you can only like just pick up the pizza. And like, I know they still exist. Wait, am I gonna die if I go down there? See, I can't tell what's the floor. Okay, so there's a card up there. Great. Okay. Can I get back up there? I think I can. Where did I see that card? Up here? Is that up here? Fuck! Okay. Every Aaron play stream makes you hungry. I'm sorry. Book it! Oh my god, book it, Nintendo fan! That was- oh my god, I got- I had one of those big buttons that said book it. Oh my god, I need to find that. I know I still have it. Yes. Book it, um, was great. That's awesome, you tank. You used to play Sims with your old ice skating rink. So I think I only got... I only got one card here. I'm very scatterbrained tonight, so I apologize. So I might need you guys to remind me of stuff. Damn it. I was hoping he would, like, go over me. Got this asshole. Okay, so I'm trying to remember, I think I have to jump outwards. Nope. Fuck, we have to jump inwards. God damn it. Well we'll we'll get it. We're gonna get it. I am determined, you guys. We're gonna get that card. God, that was close. Woo! Oh, cool. Woo! Oh my god, that went everywhere. That's what she said. Oh my god. I thought, I don't know. I, I thought that was something else. Fuck, whatever, whatever. The card doesn't count if you don't complete the level and you grab that one again. Oh, god damn it. So this one just counted, right? But now I have to go back. Oh, my kids. Fuck! So I think, okay, let me try to remember where that other card is. What?
Okay, so we got that one. Nintendo Twitch. McDonald's should sponsor Aaron. Shouldn't they, Rep Catcher? They really should. Wait, did I not beat something? Hold on. Two cards in Birdie, stage one. Oh, yeah, that's right. I fucked up stage one. Unless I'm misunderstanding. Wait, so do I have to do this one over? Because it wasn't letting me go anywhere else. I don't know why I'm blanking right now. Go talk to Ronald. Okay, well, I don't think I can get out of here. Oh, well, I just killed myself. It was one of the first games you played. That's awesome, Sandvik. Mike is also chatting about fast food. Wow, you have found enough of my puzzle cards. Hurry on to Birdie's Treehouse. Town Burglar was last seen there with my bag of magic. I don't have enough... I don't have enough Birdie um, McDonald's memorabilia. I need to get some Birdie stuff. Oh my god, there she is. Hem burglars run off to Grimace's world. If you can find five of my puzzle cards, I can show you the way. Oh, uh, thanks so much, Havoc. I will be streaming more Castlevania stuff. It's just, I'm trying to mix it up a bit. Your first game was Super Mario Brothers Duck Hunt. Not a bad way to get started. My first game was Yoshi's. Oh, how do I get that? Oh, look at your eyeballs. Boop. My first game was Yoshi's Island. Is that a pickle? Like, what is that? I think it's a pickle. So I'm going to see if this thing takes us over there to get that card. I bet it will. Maybe not. Just kidding. But what if it does? Okay, it doesn't. Hey, Photon. There's pickles in the clouds. Shit, why did I do that? Oh! That was actually okay? Wait. Just give me a minute. Looks like an eggplant. Plant purse. I don't know what I did with it, but it was shaped like a eggplant emoji, and it's funny. Boing! Ever had a fried pickle? I have not. Do you like fried pickles? You know what's weird? I hated pickles, and then I became vegetarian for about five years. I'm not anymore. 
but during that time I feel like my taste buds kind of evolved because I started eating pickles and now I like pickles and I started eating mustard. I used to hate mustard like the smell of it would gross me out like I just couldn't but I think it's just because you know you kind of were for I was kind of forced to try new things because I wasn't eating meat and it's like I now like pickles and yeah what am I doing not that you know what? I'm gonna take a really really quick break because I need more water and coffee and then we'll be right back so it's give me like two minutes If I can find the BRB screen, there it is.
What's up? Sorry, that was a little longer than two minutes because I ate a cookie and the mic was also on break. So he was telling me about his conscious stuff. We were laughing because we're both talking to you guys about fast food. <laughs> so that's what's going on. You want an Orange Julius? Oh my God, there was an Orange Julius in my mall when I was little. And I used to really like their corn dogs. Guys, talk about working out. I need to work out. I went to the gym like two weeks ago in the middle of the night and it was like freezing and nobody was there. And it was great. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go like three times a week. Haven't been back since. Um, I don't think you're going to be able to post links, but you can whisper it to me if you wish. Yeah, what does Orange Julius taste like? I don't know if I ever had the actual drink. <sighs> Thanks, Joshua. Delicious pink goo. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. Oh God, planks. You do one minute planks three times a day. I guess that's doable. Like I could see building up to that. I tried to do one and I think I lasted 10 seconds. Shit's hard. Hey Viking wizard, I'm good. I'm just Playing some of my kids, drinking some coffee, having a good chat with the chat. It's a good time. You can hold a plank for almost three minutes. Oh my god. <sighs> Alright, so Mike was saying I should probably start writing down the cards, like where I found the cards and how many cards I found at each level because it's going to get out of control. Well, thank you, Buzzin' Frog. I didn't think of it that way, but I guess it kind of is. See, I tried dyeing my hair yesterday. I used this more pinkish dye because I thought my hair was like pale enough and it didn't do anything. So the pink looks pinker, but the red still needs some work. Hair, dying your hair is a bitch, you guys. Mike is showing and telling. What is he showing? Five bags of shit. What did you get at McDonald's, Tinkus? But yeah, so basically I put, I spent time, I, you know, I put foil over the pink the super pink part so they want to get dyed and then I put this dye all over everything else and you can't even tell it did nothing but it was an experiment so whatever you used to bleach your hair I used to bleach my hair too never get your hair bleached after being out in the Sun oh my god a pain like you would not believe my god that would hurt because you wouldn't know your scalp was sunburned and then you go get your hair bleached. Oh my god. I had to like, one time, like I was, I could handle it because I got used to it. I just accepted, you know, shit hurts, whatever. But one time I actually had to have her like rinse it out because I was like, I can't handle it. That was dumb. But then I learned. Don't, don't dye your hair. Um when you've been in the sun. Even now when I get my hair dyed, like my roots dyed with regular hair dye, if I've been, um, if my scalp is like sensitive at all, it still kind of stings. Not as bad as when it would get bleached, but ugh. people don't realize that that really hurts. Beauty is pain, right? Right. What a fucked up world we live in, huh? <laughs> Oh, there's a card. Look at this crazy clown. Fuck. Oh my god. Alright, 
Sarah is trying to get you there, aren't they? There's way too much for her. Hold on. Did you ever copy Britney's hair? I think you know the answer, she she. Yes, I did. I had the poofy poofs. I remember going to a sixth grade dance and I dressed up like her in the crazy video. I'm dating myself here, but it's fine. You copied Marilyn Manson's hair from the dope show and his other videos? That's awesome. Man, I miss TRL. Thank you so much, Directrix, for subscribing for six months in a row, and thank you. I'm glad you like my hair. Crazy is an iconic video. I don't give a fuck. I really like it when she has the glasses on. Oh, Brit Brit. I used to want to be like Carson Daly when I was younger. <laughs> I was like, I want to be, I want to be like Carson Daly and host a music show. Man. I met, I use met, I use the word met loosely. I, I met, so this is a really fucked up story. Cause it sounds like it's not true. I was at a show at the Troubadour in LA. I forget what band it was. Anyway, this was like, I was like early high school. So I think this is like early 2000, like 2003 maybe. And, um, this was, like, a little bit after the show ended, and, like, we were still inside, and, um, I accidentally, like, this, like, drunk person knocked into me, so I got knocked into the person behind me, and you know who it was? Fuck. It was Carson Daly. And then... I was like, oh my goodness, you're Carson Daly, and he was like, hello, in Carson Daly voice, and then, <laughs> and then I saw who was with him, I'm like, <laughs> you want to know who was with him? This is the most, like, it's the funniest shit, I'm not making this up. So, I didn't see who was with him then, but then, so at the Troubadour, it's like, there's like a window upstairs where you can like, it's like for VIPs, and sometimes the curtains open, and you can just see people up there. He was with Fred Durst from Limp Biscuit, and I was like, what the fuck is happening? Jennifer Love Hewitt? <laughs> I swear to god, I've had the most weird celebrity encounters. But um <laughs> Yeah, so it's just funny because it's like remember that um Remember that uh Urban Heaven video where they had Carson Daly and Fred Durst in it? Or Britney in the middle? Yeah, he's cute, but I think he's married to Kim. He that part so that was like that, but in real life. It was amazing. It was so funny. Like, people probably think I'm lying, but I'm not. I, it almost feels like a dream. <laughs> it's just like, how the fuck does that happen? Is that thing gonna come back? See, I don't know where to go from here. Jennifer Love Hewitt. What was she in Party of Five, right? And I know what you did last summer. God damn it. I should do an IRL stream where we just talk about our most, our like weirdest celebrity encounters. It'd be so much fun. Look at me! 
Oh shit, I remember this part. This sucks. Oh my god. I remember the last time I played this, this took me a long time, I remember this part. Fuck! So, just prepare to sit here for a while, guys. I will look at the chat once I actually do this. Fuck! Ah, I can't get the timing right. <gasps> oh shit, we did it! God! Ooh. Look at this pickly fucker. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah! I don't get what we're doing. Oh, we're just going over here? I'm afraid. Wait, this is just sending us back. I don't know where I'm going. No! Thank you, Nick Fick, for the bits. holding a shark fin. <sighs> I just need a second. You think it's a rodent holding a shark fin? Alright, you take. I'll go with your guys' um... I'm calling him Pickles. He looks like a pickle. Did you decide to play this game for request or was it on my own? It was on my own. I was just like, I want to stream an NES game and I don't feel like streaming Castlevania just yet. So I was like, you know what? It's been a while since I've streamed my kids. Let's do some of my kids. Your mother met Andre the Giant? That's cool. Ride first cloud in this level and jump top left platform to grab first card. Okay, I think I know what you mean, Sampede. Oh, my God. Did I meet them during a VGN movie? Uh, no, I didn't meet them till way after that. Me and Mike met on the wonders of the internet. <sighs> you met LeVar Burton once? That's awesome. Alright, let's try this again. So, 
it's all the way to the left. One thing about this game, the way it just brings you all over the place like with this thing, it's annoying as fuck. It's really annoying. cloud thing again. <sighs> I panic. I need that card, I know, but like, okay, so Stampede Game. So that very first card, how do I get it? Do I get it by, let me go back, hold on. Okay, not by doing that. Okay, so that fucker right there. Do I get it by getting on this cloud? And then waiting until it gets kind of close? Is that what you mean? Because, like, it doesn't get close enough. Or, do I, or is it possible to jump? Get to that platform on the top left. Okay, I'll keep trying. Oreo McFlurries. Mm. Did I ever put Britney's first CD into a PC? It does stuff. Oh my god, I know I did. But I just don't remember what it does. Oh, thank you so much, Cure Gubicon. Wait for the cloud to get a little more height. I'm jumping too early? Okay. I'll keep trying. Oh my god, finally! Oh my god, but how am I supposed to get up there? I guess I can. Okay. Okay. So now I think I just have to jump all the way over to the left. This is stressful. There was a lot riding on this. A lot. Now take blind leap of faith all the way left. Oh my god, that's my worst nightmare. <laughs> Oh my god. We did it. Thank you so much, Stampede Gaming. My favorite McFlurry? Totally Oreo. I didn't like the M&M one because it was too much chocolate. Um, that being said, I don't really remember what the Snickers one tasted like. 
because I would always get the uh, the Oreo one. And now that that's the only option, it's like, fuck, well, I guess that's all I'm ever going to get. Because that is the only option now, right? Like, I don't think I would like the Butterfinger one. I like Butterfinger okay, but I don't love it. Thank you so much, Talking Crow! Here's another fucker over here. Woo! Whatever. We got two cards. I'm happy with that. Do we have score there? I'm not sure what that is. Boorns. Oh, those chocolate bars? I've never had one. Wait, no, no, I don't want to do that. What's in a score? Oh, we got an ice level. That's a little high Nintendo fan, because the McDonald's glasses are not they're not that rare. They're hard toffee and chocolate. Ooh, that sounds good. Ice gopher. That's what he gets. He gets to freeze to death for being a little asshole. Fuck. Woo! like the Tourette's guy right there. What's up, Ace Venom? You hate scones? I like blueberry scones. I never knew I liked scones, and one day I had one. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> you should throw up when he spins like that. I agree. You have coffee crisp in Canada? Mmm, that sounds good. Ah oh, man, I thought it was enough. All right, well, um, hmm. not entirely sure what to do there. So it seems like we missed our fuck. You'll bone for scones. You should be able to jump on them. That's bullshitty. Ooh, what's this? Ooh! Hell yeah! Any successes with the crockpot recently? You know what, Nintendo fan? I haven't, um... We haven't really made anything in a while. We've been bad. We've been eating kind of bad lately. I guess because, like, everyone's just a little stressed out. And shit happens, you know? It's hard. I think we just get bored. Like, I get bored with what we were making, but it's like, I know it's healthy, but it's like, I don't know. I, I really like... Okay, I have a question. Since you guys seem... I always seem to find an answer when I have a question. So, my friend one time at work made like he made some chili thing with like sweet potato in it and it looked really good and I'm thinking can you like dice up sweet potatoes and like put them in a crock pot or can you only um, cook a sweet potato in a crock pot like whole Vic Jetta you're the you're the crock pot wizard Look up a lemon chicken full meal crock pot recipe. It's crazy good. Is it really lemony tasting? Like, does it taste like lemon? Because I know sometimes, like, sometimes, like, lemon pepper stuff. That's good. It doesn't taste like full-blown lemons because I don't like lemon-flavored stuff. 
Uh, yeah, I probably wouldn't like that. Ooh, tasty Thai dishes. That sounds good. See, I'm not much of a cook, but, like, I can throw stuff in a pot. <laughs> so, I'm like baby steps, you know? Like, would they get, would the sweet potatoes get too, like, soggy? I don't know why, but I'm afraid they're gonna get soggy. I don't know why. <laughs> I guess I could just Google it. I'm just curious to see. Oh my god! You can make snowballs! Oh my god, I didn't know that! <laughs> yeah, fuck you. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Oh, man. Yes, Erin, you can put sweet potatoes in a crock pot, add more veggies and whatever meat you want, some herbs and spices. Okay, I don't know why I thought, like, because I googled something and someone said something about, like, sweet potatoes, like, you gotta, like, fry them in a pan first or something, and I was like, really? Ooh, add white wine. See, I don't know about cooking with wine. You're like opening my life up right now, Big Jenna. Now let's all enjoy a refreshing glass of turnip juice. No need to go upside down, just exit level. Okay, well I fucked that up. Cook a roast in red wine. Wait, was I on level two? I don't know what's going on anymore. Aaron wants to drink wine, not eat it. I mean, you kind of have a point. Oh, did you guys notice? You, oh, you can't see. Can you see my Valentine's Day lights behind me? I have heart lights. Oh, fuck. Ah! I hate these guys so much. Yeah, fuck you. I'm gonna try cooking more stuff in a crock pot. Whoa! What's your, what's your favorite thing to cook in a crock pot, chat? Oh yeah, no need to go upside down, you said. So now I just need to find um, another fuck. <gasps> a bottle of snowman. Chili in the crock pot? Ooh, that'd be good. Minestrone, Italian curry, damn, you guys got all kinds of things. So if you guys think of anything good, I'm gonna write that down to try to find a recipe, because like, I really do want to try to eat better, but it's just, it gets so boring. Hey Derek, try tip roast chicken. Oh cool, night shift. Balls of meat in a crock pot. Pig's dinner. I have no idea what you're talking about. Isn't soup great? I like that that's what we're talking about. Okay, so let me try to focus on this. the ball. Fuck! 
hate you. What's over here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't know the floor instantly goes away. Perfect conversation for wintry days. Exactly, Dancing Danny. What was my Simpsons reference? I, I don't even know what I'm saying right now, Shishi. <laughs> Just buy the cooking game, a thousand cookie recipes on DS. Oh my god, I never thought about it. You know what else I was going to stream today? I was going to stream Cooking Mama. Because now I have a capture card on a 3DS, and I'm excited. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I... Sometimes it's like I forget that's a um, Simpsons quote. I haven't seen The Simpsons in years, but I watched it so much every day as a kid. So, um, it's just like ingrained. Oh, fuck. <sighs> fuck. Cause he's right where I need to be. See, they respawn. It's like, I can't... I'm so confused, hold on. Okay, so now this guy moved, okay. Never mind. Do you ever do that where you've been saying something for so long you forget where the reference is? I'm like that with um, Teen Girl Squad from Homestar Runner and like Tourette's guy and stuff like that. Like Teen Girl Squad, I, I say like like for years, like, let's go shopping, or like, math, or like, I have a crush on every boy. These clothes smell like grandma's. And it's just shit that I've been saying since high school. And it's like, oh. <laughs> that's from, that's from fucking whatever. God damn it. I'm not playing well tonight, you guys, so I'm really sorry, but we're having a good conversation, so deal with it. <laughs> oh. Wait, what was I? I'm like forgetting what I'm supposed to be doing. Hold on, hold on. Let's just, hold on. Fuck, okay, whatever, it's fine. No need to go upside down? Okay, I won't go upside down. I was just seeing if anything's okay. You gotta grab the cards in stage one again because you got a game over. Yeah, I just realized that. Do they still sell the kick and the cheat plushes? Oh, thank you, Big Jenna. They've been making new videos, really? There's new Homestar videos? I did not know that. Alright, let's do this shit again. You know a Simpsons quote I used to say a lot as a kid? I remember my grandma would hate it. Where he's like, I wash myself with a rag on a stick. Like when I was little. Oh, fuck. 
I thought that was like the funniest thing. I would quote that a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that episode was really funny and I was little Fuck <sighs> Or like Malk Like all we have is Malk or whatever There we go! Fuck! Thank God! too far in this game. Very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. And yes, that's a good point, Nintendo fan. At least I got an extra life. pressure.
got that. Now, gonna get one more and we're gonna get the fuck out of this level. Farming lives is important in this game. Yeah. It's funny. I'm looking at how it's capturing. This background looks very pink. And on my um on my monitor it looks like a pale like rose color. Interesting. At least it looks better for you guys than this for me. I got quiet. I needed a moment, she she. Just to like calm down. <laughs> Nuke the whales. So you guys are saying like Simpsons quotes that I don't know. That I have forgotten. Remember bubble tape? I do, Darth Sphinx, I do. You know what? The other day, Mike brought up um, Big Red commercials. And I was like, oh my god, I forgot about Big Red commercials. I forgot about Big Red Gum, and this all came up because a YouTube comment, someone called me Big Red, and he was like, oh god, that's a bad nickname. And then I was like, oh, like the enemy from Bring It On, and he's like, I don't know what that is. I'm thinking of the gum, and that was the conversation. Elf is back in pog form. Fun fact, I still know, I wonder if I can recite the entire opening of Bring It On. Big Red is a Simpsons character? Are you fucking serious? Really? I need to look that up. I don't remember that. I just dropped my controller. Snack foam. I should see Blue Crush. I saw Blue Crush. I don't remember it at all. I saw it in theaters in like middle school and I don't remember it. That's with like Kate Bosworth, right? I remember I really like it. Do I remember bubblegum cigarettes? Yeah, I kind of remember those. Juicy fruit, ju juicy fruit. <laughs> juicy fruit's great. Hubba bubba. Drumline, oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, sorry. <laughs> For some reason, the movie drumline just made me laugh. What's happening? Hold on, I need to get a tissue, I'll be right back. I'm not even gonna turn the BRB screen on because it'll be like one second. Oh my god. There was something I wanted to show you guys. Hold on. Hmm. What was it? I was cleaning up my room. Oh, I know. I don't think that. Oh, no, no, no. I remember. So, I briefly showed this in my, um, I think there was a shot of it, maybe. 
I don't remember. In my, um, I'm going to go full screen. So I think there was a shot of this in my um, show and tell video, but I don't totally remember. Anyway, so I remember this clock being advertised and I remember a friend had it and I never had one growing up. And then I was driving and I passed a garage sale and I saw this like just sitting there calling to me. So I pulled over and I bought it. And this is what it is. The Nickelodeon alarm clock. I want to plug it in because it makes a noise. There we go. So the volume's up. It's going to work. But yeah, I don't remember what else it does. But anyway, so I just wanted to show you guys that real quick. I think it's cool. It makes me happy. Yeah, fucking awesome. Isn't being an adult the best because you can buy all the shit you didn't have when you were a kid? It's awesome. All right, we'll go back to the game. I just needed to show you guys that. Because it makes me happy. When does the new YouTube video come out? Whenever I'm done editing it. So soon. In a couple days. Believe me. I wish it would come out faster. But. I don't know. See that's why I can't like give um. I could never really live up to a schedule. I don't think on YouTube videos. Because some videos take longer to edit than others. Um, you know, it depends on life and like what, how much time you have to get stuff done, but I want it out very soon. If you like fast food, you will appreciate it. That's the hint. When am I going to go buy some GAC? Funny you mentioned that bosom frog because I was talking about GAC with Mike the other day. I'm going to write that down and I want to buy some because I never had any when I was a kid because my mom was like, it's going to get in the carpet, Aaron. I was like, but I want it. And then in science class, we made some. But I want, like, legit Nickelodeon GAC. And we can talk about it on stream. So I'm going to buy some. GAC smelled horrible. Oh my god, Mega GAC is in the stream. Your bedroom looks like one big antique shop with 80s and 90s toys and games. That's awesome. Schnozberry? What's a Schnozberry? Do they still make it? I think they do. I think they do. And if they don't, then I won't be buying any, but I'm pretty sure they do. And they also have some that's like kind of foamy. Um, where I feel like it looks like there's like beads in it or something. Do you know what I'm talking about? Floam! Maybe that's what I'm talking about, you tank. Well, you know what? Maybe I'll buy both and we can do a comparison. Be great. That's Floam? Okay, so it is Floam. How fun is that to say? Floam! See, I'm losing my mind because this fucking game is driving me crazy. Granted, I'm always a little bit nuts, but I'm extra nuts because of this. <sighs> Let's 
Blubber. Fuck that movie. I was so stoked to see that movie when I was little. I just really liked the little flubber guy dancing around. And then I saw it and I was like, oh, this sucks. At least little Aaron thought it sucked. Maybe adult Aaron has more mature taste and can appreciate um, the art of Disney's flubber. But I don't know. I remember my dad took me to see it at the El Capitan Theater in LA. And it was like they did this big flubber event. Like I remember like Disney characters came out ahead of time and they were like, yo, we're gonna see flubber. And everyone's like, yeah, I'm really pumped. Fuck. And then we saw it and I was like, oh. So maybe I'll like it now. Do you remember those things with straws and you could make bubbles? They're off shelves now, do the stuff that made bubbles with toxic. Oh yeah, I remember that. You would buy it like at the grocery store? I totally remember those. Did I get free flubber? No. You would think they would have given us flubber. We didn't get anything. Don't badmouth Robin Williams. Yeah, see, that's another reason why I wanted to see it. I was like, I was obsessed with Disney movies as a kid. And, um, and from a young age, I really paid attention to who the, um, voice actors were. Like, I have a really clear memory of being in fucking preschool and telling kids, like, oh, the voice of Mrs. Potts is Angela Lansbury. And they were like, what? Like, no one cared, but I cared. Because I was insane, probably, but also, yeah. So, like, I was like, oh my god. Like, I was obsessed with Aladdin. So I was like, we need to see Flubber. Because it's the genie. No, I wasn't happy. Shit. stream this game because I'm about to lose my mind and there's no passwords or saves which blows like I could not beat this in one city maybe if I streamed it with another person but on my own oh my god So I might switch games soon, just because I need to like save my mental well-being, you know? I don't know, I'm kind of thinking about switching to You Annoyed. It's kind of in the same um, vein. Or I might be able to switch to Global Gladiators. I've actually, I don't think I've played that. I bought it like two years ago and I haven't played it yet. I, I do that. I like buy games and it takes me forever to like play them. Patch Adams? I forgot about Patch Adams. never saw Awakenings. I haven't seen a lot of movies, you guys, so. Death to Smoochie? I've never seen it. I know people, like, have a lot of strong feelings about that game. I mean, movie. And you know what? Fuck it. Let's just get the cars, get the fuck out.
God. Yeah, kill yourself. Stupid gopher. No! Just one card in stage two, avoid upside down. Frozen groundhog? Hell, that's right, Hexgrex. Asshole's gonna be back. Okay, right, I don't want to go upside down. Okay, but isn't there something over here? No? guys I'll be right back one second back. <sighs> oh, it's that crazy of a game, you think? Yume Penguin Monogatari. So what? Hold on. Fuck! See, I don't know how you're supposed to deal with those things. You know what, guys? I think I want to switch to Yonoid.
I think I need a break from it, kids. I do want to come back to this, but um, I just, it's driving me crazy and I'm not in the mindset for this right now and I know my limits. So let me go grab you annoyed. I'm not gonna go on break because it's like, it's fine. We don't need the cover. That's gonna take too long. I always update this. Is that yo noid? Yo exclamation point noid. Thanks for hanging out, Nintendo fan. I should get a free Domino's for streaming this. I agree, Directrix. All right. <sighs> All right, so let's try some Yonoid. Oh my goodness. Oh, isn't this similar to another game? I forget which one. The Noid used to freak me out when I was little. I think it's his face, like it's just kind of unsettling, you know? <gasps> uh oh, so I don't really, let's see. So this is basically my first time playing this. Not sure why I died there. Still freaks you out? Yeah. Cine parts? I've never had those. That sounds good. He looks like a donkey? Yeah, he kind of does. Is that the Domino's mascot? Yep. Back when everything, back when every game had a ma had, back when, fuck, what am I trying to say? Back when like every commercial advertisement thing had the game, it was great. So as long as the platform doesn't like go underwater too much, you're good. Shit. The trick to Yonoid is to find the bonus levels to gain more continues. Okay. You work for Papa Gino's? I don't know what that is, Death Metal Gym, but what's up? <clears throat> Even the 7 upload logo had a game. I know Corvallis. I think that was great. Why didn't the Energizer Bunny have a game, you know? He should have had a game. I have a plush of the Energizer Bunny. It's still at my parents' house, but I should like, I should bring it back with me. 
next time I go there. It's so great. I was really into the Energizer Bunny when I was really little. And that's one of the first um, stuffed animals like that I had. Energizer Bunny. Had spot for Game Boy. That's awesome, Noe Junkie. You have the Energizer Bunny stuff too. That's awesome, you think? Use the Roro, the Roro. Use the Yo-Yo on the big scrolls to get power up, similar to Castlevania, and you down and B to use them. The small scrolls give you ammunition, like in Castlevania. Okay, I think I know what you mean. Use the yo-yo on the big scrolls, and then plus down and beaties. Okay. Is that the Tick's brother? Looks like him, huh? Okay, so yo-yo. Yo-yo. Ah! Are you hungry for pizza? I'm not sure how I feel about it yet. Damn it. There's a new Teddy Ruxpin? What the hell? You have a Splash Pop and a Little Caesars guy? Oh my god, I'm so jealous for every season. I just got way too excited, but that's amazing. Best mascot. Hmm. That's a good question. Energizer Bunny is really good. I really like, um... Hmm. What other mascots are there? You know what I like? It wasn't really a mascot, but there were some old Pizza Hut commercials that were like, it featured a piece of pizza that was kind of like Mr. Bill. That was one of my favorite things. Smokey the Bear video game? Oh my god, there should have been. Sorry guys, keep yawning. The Toys R Us half. Jeffrey was good. Oh shit, that was crazy. On the big scrolls, it'll give you more ammunition. Oh, okay. <laughs> What's up, Super Jeff? Shit. for video games. But I'm having fun. 
Maybe it's the universe telling me to edit. <laughs> fucking game. No! It's because I stopped drinking coffee. Maybe I should have kept drinking coffee. to expect from this game, really. I just knew it was a platformer. Why does he wear the mask? Because he has a lot of secrets to hide. Have you ever played Ratchet and Clank? No, I haven't. I don't think I've heard of that. He's on the run from the fuzz. Or he like pissed off um, Papa John. All right guys, so I'm gonna go for now, but thanks so much for hanging out. This was a fun stream. I'll be back very soon with something else, either more of the kids, Castlevania, I don't know. But um, I know you guys like the NES stuff, so I'll keep doing, I'll do some more of that. You tried the YouTube Studio Beta, it's terrible? Yeah, I, I can't. I don't like it. <laughs> it's gonna suck. I just hope when they force everyone to use it, that it'll be totally done because switching between both is very annoying so hopefully it's good but yeah so have a really good night thanks so much for hanging out and i will see you very soon a new video coming soon too i just gotta finish editing it all right have a good night <laughs>